So I'm going to answer another question. Are CAT scans dangerous? Okay, let's talk about that. Well, yes they are and they come with some huge risks. Um, a CAT scan of the abdomen is equivalent to being exposed to over 200 chest x-rays or 1,500 dental x-rays. The problem is it's ionized radiation, which means it creates damage within the DNA and also causes cancer. It's accumulative. So the bottom line is only get a CAT scan if absolutely necessary. I would recommend doing an MRI or an ultrasound instead if you could. The FDA has stated that 30 to 50% of CAT scans are medically unnecessary. So if they're saying that, it's probably more like 70 or 80%. Now here's the problem. The cancer that you would get from having all that accumulated radiation is delayed. It doesn't show up right away. It shows 10 years down the road. So if you've been exposed to a lot of CAT scans, here are some things that you can do to minimize the damage and to help uh, reduce the effects of radiation in the body. High quality seek help is really good to counter the radiation. Spirulina, wheatgrass juice, chlorella, extra virgin olive oil, cruciferous vegetables, sprouts, especially the cruciferous sprouts, green tea, curcumin, and there's many other superfoods that can help you. So it's all about balancing the accumulation of radiation and doing things to actually protect the cells against the radiation as far as your diet. Another reason to eat healthy in large amounts of vegetables. Thanks for watching. Hey, if you're interested in finding out the underlying cause of your body issues, click the link below and take the evaluation quiz.